Apple iPhone assembly company Foxconn wants to make Tesla cars. A Foxconn Tesla, Taiwan tech giant, targets 5% of electric vehicle manufacturing by 2025. Foxconn, a Taiwanese electronic company, is already known for assembling Apple's ubiquitous iPhones. But on Tuesday, today, Foxconn chairman Liu Yangwei noted that Foxconn is now looking at electric vehicle manufacturing at its new frontier and it is hoping to assemble EVs for Tesla in the future. Apple, Tesla working together? I don't know. The Foxconn chairman's comments were made during the company's annual tech day. The executive noted that Foxconn is looking to replicate its level of success in assembling consumer gadgets such as Apple's, uh, Apple's iPhone to electric cars for automakers. And Tesla being the world's premier EV company would be a great client for Foxconn. So Foxconn chairman Liu Yangwei said he hopes one day Foxconn can do Tesla cars for Tesla. He's, um, here's what he told Reuters. Based on our past records for the PC and cell phone m m markets, we're about 40 to 45 percent of the overall market share. So ambitious wise, hopefully we are able to achieve the same kind of achievements like in the ICT industry. But we will start small, which is about 5 percent in 2025. I hope one day we can do Tesla cars for Tesla, Liu said, according to a Reuters report. During his talk, Liu noted that Foxconn would not really be selling its own electric cars. Instead, it wants to help its customers sell a lot of electric vehicles that will be made in the United States, Taiwan and Thailand. The Foxconn chairman added that the company is currently negotiating with partners in India and Indonesia. Liu noted that Foxconn could offer a lot to EV makers as the company will be leveraging its 40 years, uh, 48 year old roots in ICT manufacturing to potentially halve EV design times and slash development costs by a third. Despite challenges of conflict in Europe and COVID globally, Foxconn has maintained our EV strategy. Supply chain resilience has always been Foxconn's DNA. Our global footprint in 24 countries gives us a huge advantage to meet EV industry demands, Liu said. Tesla has not released a statement about the Foxconn chairman's statement. However, the electric vehicle maker has made a name for itself for being a company that values vertical integration. Tesla has focused on making its vehicles and their components in-house, with the company currently looking to produce batteries for its cars. This was despite the company also inking large supply deals with key battery makers such as Panasonic, Cattle, and LG Energy Solution. Tesla, however, has ambitious plans for the future with the company aiming to produce 20 million cars annually by the end of the decade. To accomplish such a task, perhaps the EV maker should probably consider partnering with companies like Foxconn, which already have extensive experience building tech devices. So Foxconn hopes one day it can make Tesla cars in Taiwan. But why would Tesla ever want to pay a third party to manufacture its own cars when it is doing such a great job itself? Hypothetically, if it enabled them to increase production quicker and increase profitability. In practice, it seems unlikely. On the other hand, Tesla might be making phones and computers for sale one day. But that's unlikely for now. So what do you think about all of these friends? This is Armin Haryan from TalkNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news. Ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage. God bless you, everyone, and I'll see you soon in our next report. Thanks for watching, and thanks for sharing in your social media for discussions.